I just went on an epic hike and I was going to record a video on it, but that didn't work out because I couldn't remember the name of the app that I <laughs> for this microphone. Oh my god, how irritating is that? I don't know if you're gonna be able to hear me. Hopefully you can. I wanna leave this music on. I don't know why it's playing still, but that's great. I love it. So I did a video a while back where I mentioned um these supposed self-aware narcissists that are all popular nowadays. Like, oh my god, you guys, you fall for like the stupidest shit. I mean, I get it. Like, people fucked you over and you're pissed. And so you want to listen to all these people that are telling you about it. But no offense to them. The shit they say is minimally helpful. And they're self-aware narcissists that are teaching you how to, like, abandon them and um, hate them more and it doesn't make sense to me. A real narcissist would never do that. They won't ever admit anything if they're a real narcissist, period, no matter what. And they will always just be making excuses for the shit that they do. That's a real narcissist. So. If you're dealing with a really, a true live narcissist, there's no way in hell they're going to be making no self-aware narcissist videos. Um, those people might have just been dicks. Or I think that, like, the female one, she kind of amused me for a while, but then I got, like, bored. I think she just got hurt by, by what she believes is narcissist, and so this is her, like, revenge. that's fine but what we're dealing with is everyone's fucking broken on all angles and that's why you, you people do all this fucked up shit to each other like you can't just fucking like back off just live and let live like actually love people and let them live the way they want to live because that's the way they want to live and that's what they love and then just love them right like you get tricked into shit treat it like shit and you stand there and take it because once in a while they're nice to you you're a fucking dumbass you need to be pissed off at the narcissist the narcissist they're just smarter than you because they know how to be a dick and get you to do whatever the fuck they want I mean they're geniuses like, I refuse to be like them because I have, um, expectations of myself to be a certain way. And so, I, I, I live within my standards of how I want to be, what I, what I want to see on this planet Earth. And even if I try to retaliate against people, like, that shit hurt. It's a lot of work, man. Hate hurts. All this bullshit hurts. So I just sit back and I feel slightly annoyed at times, but then I just tr try to understand. Like, I go, you know, I convince myself of things that are most likely valid. But just, you know, what are the arguments you can come up with to justify the stupid shit that narcissists do? To actually create the very thing that they themselves hate and are pissed off about and retaliating against. It's like they had this great thing and then they fucked it over and then that thing left and then they acted like a little bitch about it. Like, wah, wah. They're a little victim bitch too. <sighs> Bullies. So, okay. Um... We've got the pushovers and the pushers over. Does that make sense? And um, there's, you know, all these variety of spectrum, one one side or another. And it's up to each his own, right? But like. Um, you have the right to not be with somebody 
but why would you want to Jesus Christ motherfucker that, that dude just freaked me the fuck out <laughs> get off the speed dude fucking A get off the meth I'm going with the flow of traffic <laughs> I'm kind of spacey but still there is the flow of traffic right in front of me perfectly going with me as well trying to say that like these narcissists that are um, teaching you the exact same thing these other people are teaching you aren't going to necessarily be helpful in a lot of situations because you have to stay with these people you have to continue to deal with these people and um, share kids with these people and they're fucking with your kids heads they're fucking with your family's heads they're fucking with everybody because they know how to act and pretend like they're nice it's an act. They're not actually nice. But they are. It's a fucking asshole. Piece of shit. You know. Fucking. <laughs> spoiled brat. Um. But you're the only one that knows. You're the only one that knows. What they actually really are. And you have to sit here and watch these people be manipulated and tricked and bought and fucking acting like complete whores. And that doesn't mean sexual, okay? You can be, you know, a whore in the sense that you're going to kiss someone's ass and think they're great just because they bought you stuff and they sat there and whatever the fuck you like for two minutes. And those of us in the know, we need to realize and um, start learning how to manage the situation. So it doesn't take, these. what these people want to do is they want to control us by making us look like this and that and the other, all these lies they spread about us and these really bullshit perspectives on how we're choosing to live our lives. It's all toxic poison, and they're poisoning people with it. So this would apply to those of us who have left the narcissist. Or otherwise, personality disordered person. Like, these motherfuckers could have who knows what the hell personality disorder label. Who cares? People labeling them are a bunch of idiot drug dealers anyways, and they they get that shit wrong, and then they themselves get manipulated by these people like they're a fucking joke. <laughs> Biggest damn joke I've ever seen in my entire life. I just sit there and look at these people like, you went to college for how many years? And memorized a bunch of what? Because it made you dumber. You don't even know how to deal with actual people. I mean, you're like a fucking professional of the highest up thing, and you're getting manipulated by these dumb motherfuckers that couldn't even keep us. <laughs> Please. Ah, it's so hilarious. Like, why would you live on this earth and never just believe anyone just because they're like, hmm, oh, my little sob story, and this and that and the other. Like, these people have grown up with TV, movies, all of our asses, and they, they, their biggest dream is to become a faker actor, pretender of being shit and doing shit that they're not. <laughs> I'm going to put the description of whatever this music is in the thingy. I'm not stealing anything. Go buy their music. It's, adverti- it's free advertising, dipshits. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking whoever's gonna have a problem with that. Oh, I have to see you. <coughs> Ooh, I feel good. Sorry, I lost my train. <laughs> lost my train of thought. How many minutes am I talking to myself? I feel like doing a video, not really. I just wanna get on a roll of doing my videos because I've got good shit that I feel is valuable to offer, but I get off my groove and then I'm like, eh. A fuck, fuck yourselves over, do the wrong thing, keep tormenting yourself. 
with a lot of the things that these people are suggesting you do, whether it's self or narcissist or otherwise, it's just going to trigger the monster in these people more. I've done it too. I didn't know. I've known there's a school of this shit teaching me. And so I had to teach myself because even these people that are talking about all the narcissist it's all you know like doomy and gloomy and like <laughs> they were hurt so bad it's like stop doing shit that you don't want to do stop agreeing with shit you don't want to agree with in the first place and then you're not going to be all damaged by these people I mean like with me my situation I stayed in that situation because I wanted to when I got myself in that situation because I wanted to and then when I didn't want to do it no more I got out of course, I didn't realize a lot of stuff, so I wasn't, I didn't prepare myself properly. Oops, my bad, I forgave myself already. And yes, there is some repercussions as far as the suffering of people that um, are the innocent bystanders. But what's done is done, I have to also trust and believe. Can I turn? I feel like all these cars are turning. Whatever. I'm being a terrible driver right now. I was a fine driver. Nobody got bothered by what I just did. There was innocent bystanders of my poor decisions. There was. But I also have to trust, and maybe it's bullshit, that these people were born into the situation because they had something to learn and grow from it. And I don't know if that's true or not. But I have to stay at peace as much as I can because what am I gonna do? Make myself sick going into despair? Like, oh my God, I did this fucked up thing. This really fucked. I do, I do, do go there, but I don't let myself go there and stay there for very long. It serves nobody. It's not serving me or them or anyone. So I don't know. I would just be cautious to what you're listening to because these people that are even supposedly self or narcissist are just saying the same shit the other ones are saying. It's not helpful, you guys. Give us something new, like teach us how to like live with you, how to fucking love you. That would be helpful. That would be cool. And so I, I started listening to them thinking that that's what I was gonna get. And I didn't, so I got bored. I stopped listening. That's all. I don't want to hate on anyone. And I don't want to add fire to fire. So, I'm going to try to figure it out on my own and share as much as I come up with. Peace. Gotta go.